Hi there, my name is Ben and I am a customer success manager here at Message Desk and today I'm going to be showing you how you can send or schedule a message using the inbox. Uh, in order to send or schedule a message, you can click on an existing conversation you have with one of your contacts in the inbox. So you can see I'm already clicked into this conversation I'm having with Josh. Uh, in order to send a message, I could pop down to this message compose box here. Uh, but for the purpose of this video, I'm going to show you how to start a new message if you don't already have an existing conversation for a contact or you don't already have a contact created for a particular number. Uh, so in order to start a new conversation, I'm going to go ahead and click the new message button up here. And then I'm going to get prompted with this search bar. So I can search for an existing contact I have or I can choose to create a new contact. So when I click into here, uh, I can search for an existing contact, uh, but I'm gonna go ahead and create a new contact today. So I'll just click this and create new contact button. And then when I'm prompted uh, with the mobile phone, I just enter in the cell phone number that I am trying to message. And then I'm prompted also with a first name and last name field. So this allows you to quickly set the first name and last name of that contact. If I'm not interested, I don't really have to set the first name or last name in order to start this conversation. So I can just enter in the mobile phone and get started. So let's go ahead and save this contact. It's gonna drop me right into the conversation here. Uh, in, or in order to send a message, I'm going to go down here to my message compose box and I can go ahead and just start typing a message. So I'll go, hey there, my name is Ben. In order to schedule a message, you're going to go ahead and look at the right side of your message compose box and click on schedule message. It's this little, little uh, calendar icon here. Uh, if I go ahead and click that, I will get prompted uh, with this message preview. So I need to choose the send time for this message to actually go out. Uh, so I can select the date and time here. So let's say I want it to go out on Thursday and let's have it go out at 8 p.m. And then I can click OK. And then once I've confirmed my send time, uh, it's ready to go. I can also choose to set it to go out at a specific frequency. So if it's a happy birthday message, maybe I want to choose for this message to go out annually. Um, or you can choose between any of these options like monthly, biannually, end of month, uh, so on and so forth. You do need to have the advanced scheduling feature uh, in order to set a frequency other than send once. So just be aware of that. But otherwise, uh, it should be good to send this. Uh, so you can see that it's going to go out on June 29th at 8 p.m. And then I can go ahead and confirm this schedule here. Then I will get a confirmation that the message has in fact been scheduled. Uh, in order to see that scheduled message or cancel it from sending, uh, I won't initially see it when I drop into this conversation here, but I can always filter down just to see uh, my scheduled messages that are going out to this number, and then I'll see it right here, uh, and I can go ahead and cancel that if I want. I'm going to go ahead and go back to show messages and comments. And then if I want to send a one-on-one -on -one message uh, right away, uh, it's the most simple way to do this. So I can go, hey there, my name is Ben. And then I can go ahead and click this send button right down here at the bottom right and send that message away. Uh, you will be prompted with a message preview again and you can go ahead and click send now. If you want to uh, turn off these message previews, you can do so uh, in your settings and then inbox settings. Uh, I hope that helped a lot. That's how you send or schedule a message in Message Desk. If you have any questions, you can feel free to click the help button in the bottom left corner of your app at any time to get a hold of our team and we'd be happy to help.